Well, her fans include Gwyneth Paltrow, Jessica Alba and Dennis Quaid. Welcome to LA-based cookbook writer Alina Furman, otherwise known as Superlina. It's really nice to have you here in the studio. I'm so happy to be here. And it's a funny way that you got here because I got an email from um, actor Miranda Harcourt and said, I've got this friend and she's in town for a wedding and she's great and you should talk to her. <laughs> and it was you and she was indeed right because you've got quite a fascinating past really, haven't you? Haven't you? Yes, she did start off as a CNN journalist, I hear. So tell yeah. us what was going on there. Well, I've been a journalist basically my entire career, and I think I'm once a journalist, always a journalist, right? <laughs> I don't think it ever it ever ends. <laughs> and uh, so um, I've worked in television news most of my career, and uh, then um, and at CNN and uh, covered some wars, and then ended up going to um, cover travel and lifestyle and wellness for magazines, and in 2009 had uh, a little bit of a detour um, in the form of a health opportunity, as I call it, and uh, was diagnosed with breast cancer and decided to kind of, being a journalist, research what it's all about, mm -hmm. you know, and decided not to take anybody's word for what it is and figure it out on my own. And so I started uh, researching um, all of the different uh, ways how basically how how does our body work what does it take for why do we get cancer cells how, why do they multiply what goes on there and so that journey took me um, you know through a lot of you know a lot of I met a lot of people um, I started working with a Chinese medicine doctor and uh, with an Ayurvedic doctor with a um, doctor of homeopathy and as I was learning a lot about what it's all about at the core of it all was plants. Of course, also emotional emotional issues are big when mm -hmm. it comes to any kind of health conditions. Yeah. But healing yourself has to go through food and nutrition. And I thought that I was a healthy eater, and I never thought I ate wrong. And then so, I realized the that I did. From? Yeah. <laughs> so soups came from is at the core of each of the ancient medicines, like Ayurveda and Chinese medicine, homeopathy, was spices and herbs and mushrooms and all these various um, ingredients that we don't normally use in everyday cooking. We know how to use vegetables, but, but we don't load them with all these different spices. And so once I started um, learning that my doctor would say, okay, you have to have X amount of uh, cumin and turmeric and caraway seeds and things like that Which in your diet. Mm -hmm. And I would go, what do I do with them? Do I just take supplements? Didn't want to go that route. So I started, I went into the kitchen and started making magic potions. So you created And these that's how soups came about. <laughs> incredible soups. And you've got, uh, obviously, it's worked out incredibly well for you. And you've got the book out now, which is full of beautiful, beautiful soups Thank as you. well. And some very happy clients yeah. I hear. So tell you. us about some of your celebrity clients. That well, I don't like to tell my own, my, to toot my own horn, but, oh, um, but, I, live, no, but I live in LA. <laughs> 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 and, uh, you know, people love to eat healthy and, you know, in L.A. everybody loves to eat healthy and a lot of celebrities, you know, when they're getting ready for the red carpet, for award shows, um, you know, juicing is kind of over. Like, why starve yourself? Yeah. Um, because you want to have the fiber and the healthy, you know, mm. nutrients in your body and soups and soup cleanses actually accomplish that and you don't have to feel like, oh, my God. Can I what ask I you then, do? is Gwyneth Paltrow as beautiful as what she looks in the magazines? Is she, is she that beautiful in real life? She's really beautiful. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> she had that, she had that dewy, glowy skin, because I reckon she had glowy skin. Does it yeah. glow? Yeah. It does glow. But she's fully into it. Well, it's been an absolute pleasure having you here. It was absolute so nice pleasure. I know there's so much we could ask. You might have to get you back, because I know you've enjoyed New Zealand. Yes, so come very back much any time, so. and hopefully your book will be available in New Zealand as well. Thanks so much for sharing your story with us. Oh, for you. any further details, um, you can check out the Superlina website. It's well worth it, too.